right? I like that. Yeah, that's a good spell. This one out for something else. Yeah. Mix, mix and match. See which ones you like. What is the stone of Gary? What I. You, you, you chuck a giant boulder. There you go. I like that. Try it on an enemy to see how strong it is. Geo dude uses rock. Change that one up for something else. What? Could use a moon if I had seventy for intelligence. Doesn't really make much sense if I already have the other sword. Star shower. It's common. That's not bad. Also, I did what you asked uh, yesterday. What did you do? Take a look. <laughs> there you That's go. great. <laughs> the magic number. That's amazing. <laughs> A little bit of star scourge to, uh, you know, warm the soul. I get you. Let's see, where should I go now? But I mean, can't I, like, Power up these spirits, because Oleg really sucks. <laughs> you need a ghost grove wart, and you have to go to one of the first dungeons to get that. Ghost grove. So you need a ghost grove wart, not a not a the grave grove wart. I don't think you have any first. I don't think you. I think you have like everything but the first one. And uh, so I need one and two of the ghosts. Yeah. Pretty 
that is. You have to go back to, like, the dungeons in the first level. You have to find a dungeon. Alright. So. They. Not there. Alright, I know where a few of them are. Maybe there's one. All right. So go back to yeah. Go there. Oh, you already went to that cave, didn't you? You already went to the one where the big stone giant was, didn't you? I don't think there was any ghost grove worth there. All right. I had another idea. Go towards the beach. So yeah. Go um. Where is that? All right, see those two little tree. Okay, go down, go down, go back, go, go over to the left, up, go up, over. Yeah, uh, up a little bit more, down a little bit. There's a there's a there's a cave right around there. Oh, okay. Let's talk to Santa. Weren't you? Well, you're... Perhaps you don't need to see that no harm comes. We have a saying, lament not you, but that is our... Just the way we... Ah, wonderful. He's boring. Hmm. Alright. Goodbye. So, like I said before, there was a point where that character had a bigger, like, quest line to him, but it was scrapped. Why was that? I, I think it's because of how easily you could just kill the merchants. Also, that, that thing right there that, that will point you towards the, that statue there, will point you towards where the, where the dungeon is. But I think if, if you go that way, you'll just find it, and that's, uh, naturally. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's by that wall thing. It's like over there. Illegal. You missed. Going through uh, Ranny's thing will also give you a lot of grove warts as well. But the first one is a little harder to find. I mean, it's not... It's usually pretty easy, but it's also... If you don't go through the first couple dungeons, because you really didn't have to, you have to find an enemy that'll give you a, bear, a bell bearing that you can sell, that'll sell you them. That's the only other way to do it. Oh. Is it a ghost? Yep. You're looking for, like, little plants. Those little plants you saw before? That's what you're looking for now. Oh, okay. Uh, the plants I've been ignoring. Yeah. Ah! What was that? That's a little goblin guy. He gave you an item. He gave you a smithing stone. You know, I don't think there's any... I don't think there's any enemies in the game that'll drop growth wards. There's enemies that'll drop stones, but I don't think there's any that drop the grove wards itself. Hmm. Sneaking up on me. This one. Is that a ghost? Nah, grave. There might be a ghost grave uh, in the next uh, over here, maybe. There's a little plant over there. I'm scared. I'm pretty certain you have you have two and three, but I don't think you have one. And one is the most important. It'll start you up. <laughs> also, as you go in the game, you can't really find ones and later ones. Grave. There's there. There is a plan in this room, though. I saw it. There it is over there. Brave. Darn it, the hall. Uh, 
gosh darn barbecue. Prattling Pete. Hello. What? Yeah, there's a I so if you use that it'll make a really deep voice that goes hello. Why would you want that? It's more for like comedy. When you uh, like when you're fighting against other people, you can do that. It, it's a it's sort of a joke item. There you go. There we go. We got it. You got it. If you want to, you can fight one of the, uh... What should I call this down here? Yeah, I might as well. So I'm already, like, knee-deep in the place. You, you'll fight your first and uh, probably one of your only, um... Grave Wardens. Wait a second. Ah. Uh, well, let me get it off my face. Ooh, I'm healing. I'm healing. <laughs> they don't like it when you heal. No parry allowed, apparently. You know, Their movements are so, are so jerky. Kind of weird they don't allow you to parry as much. Anyways, let's get rid of this. 999, what the? <laughs> <laughs> do you have ghost... Which which of the ghost ones do you have? You, have? you have one now. Do you have two and three? I need two. I have three and four. Ah, that's Hmm. That's brave. Noble Ashes. Hmm. Alright, you gotta look for those, the switch thingy. Yeah. With this one, you have to go... pretty much through it. And then you have to jump down to get to it. Like, you have to jump um, on the platform that has the switch, which is oh. on the side. Okay. Alright, fine. It's a, bit, it's a little bit specific, unfortunately. You better not come back and burn me, you stupid things. Somebody turn it back on. We know he'll come back this way. <laughs>
Noble Sorcerer's Ashes. What do you think number two is? Hmm. Kaelid, obviously. Kaelid. The hardest area. Wouldn't it be like in this area? Because this is technically the second area? I think you might be able to get them in, in um, Limgrave as well. You might have to go into one of the later um, caves in Limgrave. You might be able to get them in there too. In fact, let's go for a cave in here. In, um, yeah, in this place. And try to find one over here. I'm trying to think of where what would be the easiest cave to get to. There's a lot of them like to the side. Oh, you know what? Uh, go down. There's a cave right no. there, right? That's a cave, yeah. Try that. But these are like super high hills. How would I get down to that? You can just you can just run to it. It's not on the ground. I mean, it's on the ground. Like that I here. know that. Yep, you can go from there. You just ride over there. Okay. That plant is weirdly strong, yeah. and it's going to shoot a bunch of um, homing uh, shots at you. Very weird. Get out of here. Get weirdo. I'm not finding another one of those. I, I never did. I don't think I've ever killed one of those ones. Get out of here. Go home. This is your home. Never mind. Lovely. So you remember those weird looking plant things that are on the that are on, that are on there? Those are what you those those poisonous looking things? Yeah. You can summon those if you want now. Oh, I'd rather not. Yeah, they're not great. In fact, I don't even know what they do. I don't like I literally don't know what, what they do. Like, they're not very good at attacking. The only way they'd be useful is if the enemy could poison them somehow. Because if they get poisoned, they go um, crazy and explode. Like, outside of that, there's not much of a point. Alright, guys. No more. No more. Miranda powder. <laughs> I thought we found her. That would be mold. Random mold.
tarnished golden centaur. Hey, the tarnished has something named after him. I sure do. What's he carrying? It's a herba. Delicious. Without the boar. Well, that's good. Jellyfish also have a tendency to lead you to where caves are. So if you ever see jellyfish, there could be a cave bar. Hmm. They drop brave blowers. Wait, they did? I what guess, did? I guess so. The jellyfish. The jellyfish can? You know, I've never really attacked the jellyfish. Never knew that. It's very interesting. Trying to get confirmation if that's real or not, or if I just grab something else. It sounds like you got it. Yeah, there's no cave up there. So that belt, the one with the bell, you could re you could um, copy your thing, but you already have 99 of them, so there's not really much point to even bother. I believe this one actually you have to get it from the top. You actually have to jump down. Oh, okay. So
you have to go all the way up top the, to the ledge. Turn, uh, you have to go to the cliff. And we'll just wait for it to come over? You have to wait for it a little bit. And then you, you can use a. I think there's a jump pad around here, actually. I think there's a jump pad around here. You can use that to jump on top of it. Because you'll see all the skulls on top. There's only like a two or three. I think there's only a few of the ones that have no. They have the uh, skeletal top. Is this it? Looks like it. Yeah, that's the cave. There was a spot there. Of course. Oh. Yeah, it's a real shame you can't do like use the original voices in the graphic collection. Like you have to do you have to use the uh, newer voices. Crash, the Crash Bandicoot collection. Oh. I kind of wish you could you'd be able to play as the original as well. I'm worried this game is just going to have um, stones and not gross grave warts.
He dropped something at least. Golden stone scrap. No, they don't care. Tricky walking is, uh, death. Yeah, this is a hard jump. It can be. You have to run and jump. Because just jumping from uh, that position will just get you to the ground. Probably not worth it, honestly. Probably not, but I'll give it one more shot. Yeah, sure. It's just the running and jumping, the running to initiate for a while. Yeah. It look kind of lame. Jumping in a, in a, um, a Souls game, never been. Because honestly, these games were not made for jumping. No, and they really like their jump puzzles. They do! Almost every single Dark Souls game has, a, has some sort of jumping puzzle that you have to do. What's worse? No. Uh, double Dragon. Double Dragon when they wanted you to do jump jumps. You have to press A and B together. That was really dumb. Like, that's what I really didn't like. Ah, three. Oh, I'm dead, guys. Get him, attack him, right in the center. Right on his head. Well, okay. It was just a somber smithing stone three. At one point, that would have been good. You just need one eight, and you're able to upgrade that sword fully.
chest it rains from above Yeah, I think this might just be for stones. Another elevator? Yeah, sometimes caves have like multiple. It is weird to see you get a smithing stone one in this cave. That is true. <laughs> like, Crystal knife. Oh, that lets you make crystal weapons, I believe. Yeah. There's a lot of caves that are really small, and there's other ones that are just really big. He's having trouble. I'll get him. I don't know where to go. I'll get him. Shatter Earth. I think that's the move they were just using on you, where they drill into the ground. Oh, okay. Another elevator? They're slowly going downward. 
a few elevators. I believe beating this thing will give you the ability to buy normal stuff. So what you want to do with this guy is just keep backstabbing him or doing heavy attacks until he breaks. And he's dead. Yeah, you have the ability to make the first three stones. You can buy them from the the shop. You can if you give that bell bearing to those two, the twin husks in the, and the round table hold, um, they will sell you stones. Now, where is the one that sells you grave rewards? Let me look that up. So I couldn't remember. Decided to leave the round table hold. I'm off in search of a noble scholar known as the Gold Mask to beg his instruction. We may not meet again for some time if there's any incantation. May the Golden Order shine through you. I can happily There we go. Got everything he's offering. May the golden order shine. Ah. All right, I looked up a spot in this place. They'll have. I, I'm going to put it on your map. I'm going to put it on the... It could be a picture. And it's going to show you where a cave that has the Ghost Grove Ward is. In Lomnia. So if we go there, we get the Ghost Grove Ward. Oh, okay. So over here... Yeah, it's in Lonely of the Lakes over there by the tree. Okay, so let's go this one south. Nice. Alright, thanks. Yeah. Yeah, hear that singing? Yeah. That's a bat singing. He's right there, see her? It's in Latin. She evil? Um, she will not aggressively attack you, but you can kill her if you want. I hope you've interrupted her. Fertilize you now, boy. How dare you interrupt my song, my bats? I think they're supposed to be like harpies, the the ones with the ladies. I 
just wanted to see if you wanted to talk. No. Apparently it was a no. <laughs> I ain't talking to you, Tanish, never. Cuckoo's Evergall. Yeah, fight that. It's gonna be a big old giant. Yeah, just bend down and sniff it, sure. <laughs> See that blue light? That's where he's gonna spawn at. Uh, can't summon, huh? No, not for uh, Evergales. Oh, ah, wow. Okay. <laughs> I, I told you it was a giant. Yeah. So that's a spell which summons three giant um, swords, and they're defensive weapons. So if an enemy comes towards you, they'll shoot towards them, and if it's, if it's like a normal enemy, it'll stagger them most of the time. It's actually a really good spell. I used it a lot. Oh, okay. That's the father. Remember that one lady who got killed by um, monster people? Yeah, he's back. Th th he killed all the um, misbegotten's. Oh, you don't. You have too many. You have too many uh, grapes. You can't carry any more grapes. <laughs> I mean, are you like taking his eye or something? I think that is the implication. Huh. That's kind of weird. Can I activate this? Yeah. I think you did. Yes, yes, he did. You might as well rest at it. She still don't want to talk to me. Oh no. She's like, nah, I'll never talk to him again. He's probably telling you where the Road's End cave is. Yeah, there's jellyfish around it as well. Also, when you attack one jellyfish, all the jellyfish around will become aggressive. Not that they're very dangerous, but... Pokemon move. Hmm. 
I mean, if you use the Zuchi Katana, you could always um, give it a different um, special ability to change up if you want. Do all the different things like sword dance and all that stuff. There's all a bunch of uh, because you have because the Uchi Katana um, uses the normal stones. You can use it on any, any uh, of the uh, different kinds of um, what you call it. Ashes of War. Roads and catacombs. Yep, this is the one. There are Grave Grove War Twos in here. Nice. Also, I believe there are hidden shat. There's hidden walls in here too. <laughs> He's like, welcome to my abode. You just waited for that chance. That dude. Normally, there's a lot of blood stains in this cave because of that dude. Like that dude kills you. a lot of people. That that person kills a lot of people. Hmm. Look, it's the it's the. You've already had the thing. Now go down. See that wall over there? Behind you. Also, oh, you found the grave ward already. All not, three not, grave. Not a, not a ghost ward though. Oh, it was grave. I hope I didn't look up go grave. I looked. I looked up ghost. There's definitely a ghost in here somewhere, and it might be on in that hidden wall right there. He's no, like, there. He's like, no one should have known about my secret. Oh, there. There it is. It is. Nice. Who's shooting at me? Oh, it's a goblin. Okay, so we've got one, two, three, four. Does it go any higher than that? Oh, it goes all the way to ten. Oh. Well. Going through, um, Ronnie's quest will give you almost all of them, if not all of them. Oh, okay. It'll give you the last few if, for certain, like seven, eight, nine. And the special one. So yeah, this is a cave that has a whole bunch of, um, Hidden walls. There we go. I think root raisin is an item you need to use that you you can use to feed the horse to heal them. Ah. I think. I think it's, it's either that or you combine it with something. What the? Already to the boss? Yeah. Or is it like one of those double boss things? It might be a double boss. Ah, this one's special. By the way, that's the Crucible Knight right there. Do you remember this one? Yeah, we're you do. Okay. That's you. You just passed him. What? That light right there? There you go. Flintstone Sorcerer's Ashes. Maybe there's a double box in there. Yeah. I think I think this cave is basically just a secret. Like you're supposed to get at the very start and you're not supposed to there's there's a stone back there but you don't really need it. Stone. Behind I thought I saw a stone. No, it's just a plant that looked like a stone for a moment there. 
I think compared to the previous one, I think this one's very short. I can't wait for that one to also be a two. Dog staff. Yep. If you time the if you time him coming with the arrows, you can actually kill him with the arrows. You can make the arrows shoot him in the back. Makes sense. And a lot of times you can use the traps to your advantage. He just watched. He says, I like to watch. <laughs> huh, nothing else in here. Yeah. You did it. You beat the cave. Alright then. See the whole thing is you're supposed to come all the way here and goes, What where on earth is the is the boss? And then you go back to the start, and you start hitting the walls, then you find the wall, and it's like, oh, there it is. And so compared to the layer. Yeah, it makes sense. Like, it, it's like, ooh, oh, so there's hidden walls, and then you go back. Can you open all these up? And up, there you go. Only one. Only one. <laughs> now you can level them up all the way to four. Where do you go for that, anyways? Oh, the round table. The the woman Rodrika. She's in she's she's in the same room as the as the uh, blacksmith. Oh, okay. Greetings. Are you here for spirit, Chief? Should I tell her? Or no? 
Yeah, I sure, I guess so. I need to warn you about something. A little while ago, someone started lurking in the wing on the opposite side of the rent I can hear. From all the howling and wailing of spirits in fear of a curse. A plethora of I can't even imagine. Not even the grafting caused anything. You should keep your distance. I know you're sh Interesting. I think that means that the, the, the dung eater's here. Well. I think so. No, not there. It's um where the twin husks are. Where uh what's his name? Uh Gideon. Gideon's area. He would be on that turn. There you go. The door's open. He's there. I wonder what caused him to swamp. Offer a bell bearing. You have to offer the bell bearing first before you can buy the stone. But even if you did, it would just be the first two, I think. Oh, it gives you the um, sombering ones as well. Oh, what? Ghost glow. What? Did, what? <laughs> <laughs> Are you serious? Yep. That's crazy. Good job. I don't even know what those things do. I've never bought them before. No, uh, it's just if you get invaded or whatever. Well, uh, maybe not. I think that one makes you look like the the host in case the invader. And if you if you join someone's game and someone invades, you can put that on, and it'll make you look like the host. Oh, okay. Dung eater bad. Can I even talk to this weirdo? Have you ever felt the curse? With your whole being, the pox upon life itself. Feared. And despised by all. Yeah, apparently not. You are but a lamb, a stranger to defilement, ignorant of your own. You no longer interest me. I've been long without peace. I asked you not to be thankful of the whole serenity. It is all that keeps your death and defilement. I asked you. No, know, it's funny. Thankful of the whole. It is all that. The, the Dung Eater respects the sanctity of the building, whereas Fiat killed someone here. Huh? Remember f Oh, wait. Never mind. Who was killed? No, it's alright, it's fine. You again. I thought you'd receive a summon. The oh, did you never talk to her before? You defeated him. Yes, make good use. I don't intend to make a... Ah, yes. I wonder if he's in his study. If you have an old father, he's I'm sure talking. No. You've 
received them. Then, just as I am known as a tarnished who wishes to die, I'm a Q now belong to it. You'll be after more great. Then, as you're the inheritors of the we of the Round Table know the location. Godric the Grafted, General Radan, Praetor Wright, Morgoth, and Ren. You'll still be after more great runes. So basically, he can give you information about the the first five of the characters you fight, and then as you go, he'll give you more information about other um, dudes you can go for. Oh, okay. Always good to son. <laughs> Mate, lately, I feel I'm on the precipice of falling into, and I have an inkling it could spell trouble for you somehow. So I just wanted to get the apology out of the way beforehand, since you're so scary and all. He's like, I don't want to fight you. You would literally destroy me. Why would he fight you? Well, he thinks he's he's slipping into the darkness. He's not sure what'll happen if he his body succumbs to the rock. He's got. Him. Oh, okay. Let's see. So I probably should go back over the bridge. If you want to, yeah. Oh, that's right, because.